hey guys good morning welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video and as you can tell i am outside right now but today's gonna be a vlog style video just a few errands things that i'm gonna do today i'm outside right now because i'm about to let the dogs out and feed them and i'm just gonna take you guys what i do today it's gonna be the first video of 2021 um i've just been really trying to plan out my youtube and things that i want to do and kind of like my niche niche however you say it on the things that i'm going to be doing so my hair guys look i cut it off all my curls are coming back i'm just trying something different and this part won't go into a ponytail so yeah i, I don't it's cold outside and it's actually snowing i don't know if you guys can see um this is our backyard right now you can see a little bit of the snow but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and let the dogs out and feed them and just take you guys on today with me on what i do so yeah if you want to see how this video goes and you're new to my channel go ahead and click that subscribe button give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below if you like seeing videos like this because i'm gonna be dropping videos back to back all 2021 so yeah go ahead and keep on watching before I die, I'm tryna fuck you, baby Hopefully we don't have no babies I don't even wanna go back home Hopefully you don't leave my home Before I die, I'm tryna fuck you, baby Hopefully we don't have no babies I'm tight, I'm tight usually okay so their cups aren't in here but usually i know it's kind of dark um i just get a cup and put it in each one of their bowls i guess i'll use this one let me rinse this out we usually use the little red clips i gotta do some cleaning today because i've been working back to back and by the time i get off I don't get home till like 12, so I'm actually tired. But I'm gonna sleep in today since I'm off at both jobs. Oh, just give them some food and some water. And you usually let them out when they go outside and do they get this. Come on. So yeah, let me go ahead and put them outside and I'll see you guys in a few. All right, so I just fed the dogs. They are outside eating and drinking or whatever. And if you know, if you follow me on my other social medias, which are always linked down in the description, um, I have started my keto diet. So I'm also gonna be taking you guys along with me on that journey as well. Um, I'm gonna start my day off with a breakfast drink. I don't really eat breakfast anymore and I'm too lazy to try and cook the keto breakfast, which I mean, I usually will most likely do just bacon and eggs, but I'm just gonna go ahead and do a meal replacement smoothie. Um, look at this, that's gonna bother me, which just consists of a meal replacement keto shake or drink or whatever. And then I usually just put in like blueberries, and strawberries but only a little bit so it doesn't knock me out of ketosis or whatever because you know keto is like a non-sugar diet type thing so i'm gonna have you guys watch me make my smoothie I'm trying to turn on the light but it's so many switches in this house i don't know which one goes where no no there we go so yeah guys just see all i did was get some crushed ice pour it in there i use this tablespoon to measure out my blueberries and strawberries and i usually only get like two tablespoons because those blueberries are kind of big and these strawberries are big too, so I only get like two strawberries and that's it. And plus I don't like all the little seeds everywhere. That's good enough for me. And then my meal replacement. It's only seven grams of carbs. 
I always get the ones that have like low to none, no sugar. And this only has one gram of sugar. So, and it's chocolate. And this is gonna be my breakfast for today. It's still kind of watery because I don't like it too thick. Because who's gonna try and drink all that? And then I just try to make sure that all the blueberries and stuff are blended up so the chunks won't get through my straw. And it's not too sweet, but it kind of knocks out that malty taste from the chocolate drink, from the chocolate or whatever. And it looks like it's a lot, but that's because it's in my Starbucks cup. And of course this is skinny, cause I usually just put it in like a wine glass and that's pretty much how I know. I'm not in a rush, but I'm kinda in a hurry cause I have some packages that are supposed to get delivered today. For my business like i said if you follow me on my social medias and you guys would know some of the things that i have going on i do plan on starting a business mm. that's good um some of my stuff already came in uh, probably once all of it comes in then i'll go ahead and do like a little video on what it is that I plan on doing because I'm probably not gonna launch until February 14th. So save that date if you want to support my little business. Or maybe I should launch it February 1st so that way people can order them and I could do like a Valentine's Day special or something like that, if that makes sense. But um, yeah, so I also need to hurry up because Nemo gets out of school around three. And since it's snowing, um, you know, today was his first day back at school. And I know Christmas is over, but I still have my Christmas mask. But um, these are going to be my snack. These are so good. These hottie bites, one of my coworkers put me on. And I've been on them ever since. Okay, so I have two big bag of clothes that I am donating, so I need to put them in my car because I'm going to take them to a thrift store that they have out here, it's called Savers. So yeah, let me go ahead and start putting those in the car. So two full bags. Now I'm just gonna put on my shoes, get my phone, got my keys, my purse, and I'm ready to go. So I will see you guys when I get in the car. Okay, so I just made it to the donation drive through center. Um, I'm the third car in line, so I guess I just, this is my first time doing this. I've never done it before. 
so I guess I just wait until they're done I don't know if they take it out or I have to take it out or if I have to fill out any paperwork I'm not exactly sure but I guess we just wait I'm not gonna lie either I'm almost done with this and I feel full like I just ate a full breakfast that's why I guess that's why I um let's see if I can set this right here when it broke no I just need to put my steering wheel down that's the furthest down I can go but um I just don't feel like twisting it on the tripod because the tripod I got to turn it around but anyways um I feel full and that's pretty much it this will probably hold me until like lunchtime which my lunch will probably be like around 1 1 30 ish maybe 2 Cause I actually woke up like around eight, but I took Nemo to um to school and then just took my shower or whatever, did my hair. Um, yeah, but just in case I do get hungry, like while I'm out running my errands, um, so I won't be tempted to buy like chips or something with chips isn't food or even like fast food or something like that. I always keep like a pack of these or like like some cheese sticks in my purse um so that way if i get hungry i have something to snack on and i like these because they're spicy and i try to stay away from like the hot sauce and stuff um just in case it has like its own little sugars and stuff in it and who's about to try to measure it when these have specific serving sizes and stuff and um this is only two grams of carbs and let me see 15 calories and there's zero sugars in this but I mean they're pretty good they have the regular ones and these but I like these because they're spicy and actually I was hungry yesterday so I ate a pack of these little pickles with a boiled egg and a uh, string cheese and I had one slice of like the, the, the turkey or something like at Walmart when you go get the deli meat like that so and when I was eating that, I actually felt full. But other than that, tonight I'm thinking of doing a keto meatloaf. I seen it on Pinterest. It's either the keto meatloaf or the Alfredo. Cause I did want to try to make the keto noodles. It was made out of like Parmesan cheese, um, mozzarella cheese. Egg, stuff like that but I'll probably try that for another time but yeah so anyways um the cars are getting ready to move up there's actually more cars in line so I'm gonna go ahead and scoop my car up and I will just see you guys when I get to the next all right so I'm currently in Walmart and I already exchanged my little um I had those little containers to meal prep but the corner was broke so the top wouldn't be able to snap on it so I had to exchange those and I'm currently uh, uh, purchasing the stuff that I need to make my meal prep for the week which is going to be meatloaf and rice because I'm going to use the cauliflower rice so as of right now I do got the ketchup with no sugar added um, I don't really like ground beef but I know it wouldn't taste right with ground turkey um, so I got the lean ground beef with the cauliflower rice and um i need to see what else i can get to go as like a side dish or whatever so right now i'm just kind of like walking around looking around um i got majority of the stuff at home <coughs> um but yeah so i'm just gonna go ahead and walk around and see uh, anything else that i know i need it i might need some more of those little beads that i use to wash because uh, the aroma boosters or something like that um 
Oh, and I also need to get those little bed clips for Nemo so that way I can clip his gloves on the ends of his jacket so that way he's not losing the gloves. So, so far, so good as far as what I'm getting in the store. It's not too much and I'm not gonna be in here that long. And then after this, I don't think I have to go anywhere else, but um, y'all, Walmart has been having these purses and backpacks on sale and I've been so tempted to like get them. I feel like I have a, I'm over my little collection of cups, but now I'm kind of into buying like different bags and stuff, which I need to slow my roll because these are so cute. They look hella comfortable. Now I know these are comfortable because they're always sold out. They never have my size. So, um, All right, so I am back home. I'm bad. I'm watching this recipe because I am meal prepping for the week and I am making a keto meatloaf with cauliflower rice. So, anyways, so I was in Walmart, had everything, scanned everything, was in check self checkout, ready to check out, left my wallet at home. So I couldn't even buy anything. I had to come home, get my wallet, then go back and get everything. So um, this is what I exchanged at Walmart because the corner was broken so I knew the top wouldn't snap on. But these are actually on sale, I think for like $3. Comes with five meal prep food containers. You know, I'm trying to stick with this keto. Like I have a cruise coming in July. I'm not getting right for anybody but myself. I just want to be healthy. I want to change my lifestyle. So I'm not going to call it the keto diet, as my dad said. I'm going to call it a keto lifestyle. That's what I'm going to do. And I got this cute lunch kit, and I'm probably going to add my name to it on the front or something. I don't know, but I'm just trying to keep myself motivated because you guys do not understand how tempted or how easily tempted you can be, especially with just walking in the grocery store. I wanted to grab a bag of chips so bad. And the only type of chip-like things I can eat our pork rinds and I don't even really like these but I had to use these today as breadcrumbs in my meatloaf and then I'm gonna have rice with it so it's actually cauliflower which I don't mind because I do like broccoli and cauliflower and I just put them in here so they're in there cooking I can smell them already and I'm just drinking water waiting for that to be done and I just got a notification um, that one of my packages is here, so let me check. Oop, I see it, I see it, I see it. It is my Shein package. Oh, it's a box this time. You know, I've never ordered that much stuff. But honestly, it's not a lot of clothes this time. I didn't really order too many clothes. Um, I am going to get a clothes haul for you guys. It's just out here in Minnesota It's kind of hard for me to order clothes because it's Always cold opposed to the clothes that I can order in Houston because it's not Really cold all the time so I can get like skirts and shorts and dresses and stuff and out here I've been a little skeptical to order like pants and stuff but if you guys want to see something like that, then let me know. Maybe I can do like an outer wear, like winter. But I just don't want to get too much because I do plan on coming back to Houston. And I'm going to have all these jackets and stuff. And it doesn't even get that cold in Houston. So, yeah. Anyways, I'm just waiting on this to cook. And the dishwasher is going. I already washed all the dishes. I just need to sweep and mop. But I'm going to sweep and mop after I let the dogs out again. Cause I'm gonna let them back in around the time Nemo gets home. And I'm about to throw him some chicken nuggets and fries in the oven so he can have something to eat when he gets home and just finish cleaning. So, yeah, I'll see you guys.